I will find him. I will capture him. And no one will ever die again. Ah, that's nice. Dang, proud of you. Hey, welcome back to Fire Emblem Thracia 776. Hey, I know these people. Lord Seleph, we should be on our way soon. Ah, Julia, are we out of time already? I wish we could keep talking, Prince Leaf, but I must be going. Leave the conquest of Connaught to us. I bid you to go straight to Munster. I pray you forgive my selfishness, Lord Seleph. It's not like it's already gotten someone killed in the past two chapters. Nonsense! You're not being selfish at all. I understand your feelings perfectly. You can head to Munster with a clean conscience. I'll see you soon. Yes, in Munster. You can count on it. I'll be praying for your health, Lord Leaf. Julia looks a little weird here. I don't know what it is, like... Maybe I'm just used to the FE4 portrait? But, like, I could get... Is it because her hair looks normal? I think it's because her hair looks normal, and I'm used to Fire Emblem 4 hair. Thank you, Lady Julia. Don't forget to take care of yourself, too. I really hope I didn't just miss a very important piece of dialogue there. How went your meeting with Lord Seleph, my prince? He and I are only a year apart, but he's such an incredible man. Indeed. He commands an army ten times the size of ours, and he was able to lead them across the Yi Desert. He's certainly not your ordinary youth. But you said before that he was made into a hero, did you not? I did say that, yes. And in one sense, it's true. But I'm not discounting that Lord Seleph himself possesses outstanding talent. I suspect he'll eclipse the legend of his father, Lord Sigurd, by quite some measure. And meanwhile, I'm still just a, an embarrassment to Leonster. You've grown much over the past year, my prince. In another year, I expect you'll be the same caliber of man as Lord Seleph. Now, putting that aside, what did you and he agree would be the plans for our armies going forward? Lord Seleph's main forces will go east along the shore to seize Connaught, as planned. Which frees our army to head for Fort Danzig, correct? Indeed. Lord Seleph readily granted my request. Leaving Connaught to Seleph means we can focus all our energy in seizing Must Munster. I want to head there as soon as possible. We'll have to claim Fort Danzig regardless. It controls the inland route to Munster. Our army stand by, Prince Leaf. We await your command. Then there's no time to lose. We sport we dub 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 dub. Yes, that is what we do. Everybody remembers we fight for pay, right? So don't be a hero. Wait for the enemy to break up their forces, then swoop in. Until then, nobody leave their post. Okay. That man literally existed just to um just to make sure that I understood that they won't move for a while. Okay, let me look at this map. I'm probably... Okay. So a bunch of wyverns I gotta be ready for. An uncomfortable amount of ballista. Okay. Oh, I get it. Oh no, this is plain. I just want to go down and then through here. That seems a little simple. What, oh, hold on. Oh, that's sleep staff. Uh-huh. All right. So... Dealing with sleep is, as they say... Sucks. Thankfully, I came in with a bit of a, uh... A ready tool for that. All right. So, Salem. Get right here. Let's just, um... We'll get there eventually. There we go. I don't like that you can put me to sleep. So, um... How about you have the pyramid of shutting the fuck up? Ooh, a level up for Salem, too. Did I give him any scrolls? I, I don't think he has any scrolls. That's fine, he got skill. Which I guess is nice. Sure. Alright. So, we want to make sure... Okay, so that house itself is not vulnerable to the ballista. However, the space immediately below it is... Okay, if we just stick to the left, we'll be fine with our flyers. Um, and, you know I said I'd use it on Nana. However, consider that I'm biased. If I were playing this and using Master Seals correctly, I don't think I ever would have given one to Salem. And there's another Dragon Quest monster. And here we are. Dragon Lord Edda. Hmm. Beautiful. Uh, astounding. God bless. Those are some beautiful stats. 
Wait right there. Now I can move Dean one space south of Edda and be fine. What's in this house? Ever since the Empire took over, this whole place has gone to hell. Bah, I wish I could go back to the good old days. So I don't care what you do, just drive the Empire out of here. I know this little vial seems worthless now. Just hold on to it, it'll be a Oh, more pure water. Game really likes to give Oh, pure water, that's how I would have been able to survive the sleep if I didn't silence him. Ah, oh, that that makes sense. Oh, I get Oh, and the ballistas are positioned so that I can't fight one without endangering myself to another. Oh, it's intelligently designed. I get it. I hate this game. I can make it everything harder than it has to be. All right, so we'll move Finn on down. And I'm letting him use the speed ring. Because his speed's at that, like, frisk point where more, does, where more certainly can't hurt him. Ah, right. We got, uh, Delmond. Or Dermot. Yeah, there's the Bayo Blade locked to Dermot and Fergus. Doesn't Vantage and Wrath not... Wait. Yeah, then... Why does it give both? Wait a minute. That's stupid. He does have charm, though. Charm is always nice. Yeah, we'll let her... Hold on to that. There's big boy Xavier. Guess there's really no harm in that. Alright. Fergus, we're just gonna be moving on down. Uh, should I be sending units east? I feel like I should be sending some units east. Now, there's Shanam. I have him again because... I mean, here's another vendor. And an armory. Probably have a lot of really cool stuff I can buy. We'll send Tani... Bell and of Cyan this way. I guess Farida too. But then have Macha move down here and Talion. He'll move down. He'll be right here so we can get all the sweet, sweet chocolates. Alright. Let's play my favorite game. Can I survive a single turn? Go on whenever you feel like it. Uh, you're going after Asbel. Oh. I forgot how accurate Ballista is. They're gonna... Yep, you're also going after Asbel. They're gonna have to demote. Demot? Alright, well... In that case, that's fine. Oh, there's two Ballista there. The other one's gonna hit us. Oh! Oh, God! Uh, okay. New plan. We go in the bushes... And we never leave the bushes. Alright, here's one for Fergus. Of course. But that's fine. You know, it, we're, we're fine. We're, we're fine with that. Yeah, he ran away. That's fine. I, I probably would have been really cool if I stole that sleep staff. But, um... I am okay with just not dying. All right, so let me think about this here. I'm going to want to get Finn, like, around so that I can kill that thing, kill that guy. Those two are the threatening ones. All right, so we move Asbel up. Tanya's right behind. Um, Osayan, he'll be within three spaces. And Macha will be right there. What are you? Also Venon. You're, you're both Venom. Okay, which means now that I'm in the forest, I'm really not afraid of you guys. Okay, well, maybe I'm a little afraid, but not too much. The problem are, are these. Which actually just get solved when I don't have anyone bundled up over here. Alright. So... Yeah. So Shanam can move down here. Um, I guess Finn's first priority is going to be this one. But before that, even... Wow, Toto's movement is absurdly high. Alright, battle axe and a hammer. Alright, well... Finn, this is Brave Lance. Yep, this will go perfect. So! 
Wow. All right. One hit, one kill. Perfect. Good job, Finn. All right. And now next turn, you can kill that guy. Perfect. Now, the problem is, if I put Salem right there, yeah, he'll, uh... He will definitely be hurting. Let's, um... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute, no, there's an easy way to, uh, stop this. Yep. Heal up Fergus with, um, our guy that I didn't want to be a staff bot, but has become a staff bot. I've barely ever used dark magic on him, and I really wanted to, but, like, staff utility's so good in this game! Alright. So now we rescue Salem. Right, and then we wait. Aha. Uh -huh. And then Nana heals Dermot. Yeah, and then Dermot takes Salem and drops him, and we're good. All right. Nice. Oh, would she has the pair? Wow, that would have been a like. Wow, that would have been a really smart thing to do with Nana this whole time is have her equipped with the Paragon Sword and then just have her for staff utility. That would have been really smart, actually. Wow, I... Amazing how I just didn't do that. Man, that would have been... Oh, leave the goof again. Oh, which means he can take out this ballista right here now. Perfect. Oh, light brand. How I love V. Ooh, and his Kantai apparently gets weighed down by one. I won't feel the power of the magical triangle. Now, feel the power of the magical triangle. Again. Should have had a magic stat, nerd. Get crit. Alright. I swear, does Promoted Leaf have a built-in paragon or something? Because he is getting a lot of XP. Oh, wait, he's just Prince again. Is his Promoted class just the same class, but it has the ability to use weapon? Or, blah, blah, to promote? Or rather, to level up more? Is that all it is? Alright. Here we go. We can rescue you. And then move you down to right here. Yeah. And then Dean can rescue Shanam. And he will go down to right here. And Edda will take... Drop Shanam right there. And then I guess go right here? Cool. Everyone's moved? Everyone's moved. There they are. I figured they were coming. Alright. You don't just put two forts down in a Fire Emblem game and not have them kill you. Alright. Yep. And this guy's dead. Good job, Asbel. I can't remember. Do you have a scroll equipped? Right. Regardless... The foot enemies aren't what I'm afraid of. Unless this one's going to comically make me eat my words. Well, yeah, no, you're... Yeah, what, what do you think you're doing, buddy? Sword rank increased. Nice. Good job, Fergus. And you're going after Finnegan. And... Yeah, you're... Dead. Goodbye. Level up for Finn. Alright, can you have... Well, some strength, I guess. Or, you know, just HP, that's fine, too. Alright, now, who's being attacked there? Dermot, I think. Yeah. Eat shit, nerd. Now, who did that guy just target? Oh, Asbel. Asbel, yeah, he's well protected. And now we have the two Venon Ballista. Oh, right, that reminds me. I stole the Ballista because I thought it was really funny. As I feared, yeah, you can't use them. They did sell for a nice amount of money, but no, you can't use them. I essentially just wasted two yeasts, uh, Christ, two uses of the Thief Staff. But it was funny, so I'm okay with it. Alright, and that should be everything? Oh, right, these nerds. Alright, so apparently we have started the Thracian combat. 
Uh, buddy. Are you aware of the mistake that you have just made? Genuinely wondering for a friend. They all have Rider's Banes. All my cavalry's right here. Well. Well. It's okay. It's... It's okay. We'll be fine. We can... We'll be fine. Because Leaf's going to get a level up, and it's going to be really hype. Max strength, baby. I love max strength when I'm using a magic weapon. They are all going after Leaf. Good thing that strength love love's going to come into play. Yeah. Mm. Okay, but can at least, like, adept happen? Come on. I'm due for an adept, right? At least an adept? Come on. Yeah, there we go. Eat shit, you dumbass dragon knight. Cringe-ass dragon knight. All right. All right, so they all move, but they don't all move directly ready to fight me. Which means I can still not get my, uh, my cavalry in a twist if I just put them to the left. Or have them be greeted. Okay, so here's, what is your move? Let's see here. Nine. Nine. And nine. Okay. Where's the boss? You're the boss. Your move is still nine. All right. So basically, I'm going to want Finn to do this. Oh, no, 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 no. All right. Brave Lance. You have like a 0% chance to hit him, which is cool. Oh, you know, he'll just miss a 99. Oh, Miracle. Miracle proct. I'm beginning to hate that skill. What's its chance? Luck times three? Oh, that's a 30% chance. He just gets to not die. Super cool. I love those kind of skills, don't you know? Alright, well, regardless. Alright, just don't have that activate again on me. Or, you know, have that activate again on me. Very, very cool of you to do. Alright, look. I guess now we have to freaking kill you. Just, just get you out of here. Alright, you're dead. I'll level up for Fergus. Alright, you got some scrolls. You got the Kingmaker. Strength and skill. Sure. Sure. All right. And now we essentially have to move all of our, um, all of our cavalry back due to this bad luck. I'll move Dean right there. You can, uh, go right here because Finn's in danger. He definitely is in danger. But let's see if, um, I'll have Miracle activate again. Sure. Sure. The best part is, is I have no idea if these are 99% misses, or 1% misses, or, um... 1% misses, or, um... Words, words, I have words. 30% Miracle procs, but honestly, does that matter? I don't think it does. I think it's kind of bullshit either way. Oh, God. Alright. Drop. Wait. And then wait. Okay, up here, up here, up here, up here, we can do some stuff. Kill this ballista. Get it out of my face. Or not in my face. It's definitely not in my face. The whole point of ballistas is that they are as far from your face as possible. But that's fine. No, we're fine. We're fine. Osayan, move forward. Tanya, move forward. 
Murray to move forward. All right. More soldiers that I can't deal with right now due to all these miracles. Oh, they have a vulnerary. Great. I love how that combos with miracle. Fun. All right. But it's fine. It's fine. That means they're not hurting us. Which is fine. Okay, there we go. Now all the other goons are going to be coming in. Who is that targeting? It looks like Dermot again. No, now it's Nana. Get, get out of here. So... That's, what, Asbel again? Yeah, no, that's fine. Okay. We're, we're, now the Venom Ballista. Always Asbel. Have you considered, I, I guess, Artanya and Osayan just too fast? Probably. Now that I think about it, because they don't get weighed down by their weapons. Because they're con. Alright, let's see how this goes. Uh-huh. There we go. That's fine. Yep. Well, wait, this is fine, actually, because of the light brand. Alright. Behold! Triangle! Dodge. And here we go again. And... That was actually a 99% miss. These Wyvern Knights are going to drive me insane. It's like, they don't even do any damage. This is the fact that they have Rider's Banes that makes them horrifying. Alright, there we go. An Adept proc. On another 99% miss? Are you kidding? Does Miracle just work with every single hit or something in this game? And it's like I have a 30% chance to just miss? Is it like Pavice but more annoying? I, I need to know. I, 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 I need to know. Alright, so here's the boss. Soldiers of Leonster, prepare yourselves. All right. Interesting. Player phase. All right. A fatal attack. No, those were just straight up 99% misses. Okay, okay. Silver sword. Just, just please. Please. All right, you got hit by 29. Whatever. What? Whatever. All right. Fergus. All right. You don't have the attack speed to double him, but... Whatever. All right, hang on, hang on. Killer bow. That's still not very accurate. Uh, Shannon will probably just, like, instantly die if he goes near you. All right, let me, let, me, let me look at these guys first before I worry about that. All right. Finn can definitely 100 to 0 one of them. So we'll just Brave Lance and hope to God Miracle doesn't activate. Oh my God. Okay. All right. Fine. 36, uh, Silver Sword. Yeah, okay. Please. Please. Thank you! Oh my god, Miracle is like the new Pavice or something, Jesus. Skill and defense, thank you, whatever. Alright. Now then. Um... Let me look at this here. My goal... Alright, what are you? Uh, you're 24. Etta should be able to just... No, not quite. She needs a stronger lance. Ironically enough, this will do. Alright, come on. 
Please don't. Okay, you got him. Thank you. Okay, okay. They're starting to die. They're starting to die. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, God, Buddha. You know, all those, all the, all the squad, you know. All right. What do you have equipped? Should I be worried? Did you fucking... Oh, venom lances. If that's not perfectly annoying. Oh, but you have an antitoxins I can steal. Or capture. That's nice. Anyways. Um... Let me think about this here. Looking at it how it is... Karen probably can't... Yeah, no, she doesn't even have enough attack speed to double them. Karen has really fallen off, and I have no idea if that's just, like, what happens, or mine is particularly unlucky. 18... Okay, you kill him! But if Miracle activates... I, I think I just have to accept the chance that Miracle is going to activate over half the time. The, the hell with it. It's what has to be attempted. So come on! Do your worst to me, Miracle! Yep. Sure. Well, at the very least, he didn't get his adept proc. Alright. Uh, Dermot, how well do you have? You also will kill him. Alright. Are you going to activate again? Alright, are you going to activate a third fucking time? Let's see how this goes. Oh, a cost. Or no, that was adept. All right, great. Are you going to activate a fourth time? Can we see five? Can, can we see five? C come on, give me five. Give me five. Yeah, baby! Five times! Five times! Who had five times? Did you have five times? Alright, Shannon can't fight. Six. Uh, Salem. Can we get six? Can we? Can we get six procs of miracle? <laughs> Dean? It's all up to you. Master Lance doesn't matter because you just... If miracle activates, it activates. Please. For the love of God, Dean. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six times. Attack speed of 13. Attack speed of 9. Gotta get, gotta get your name out of there. <sighs> hey, hey guys up here. How you doing? I really hope... I really hope that that genuinely, like... He's some sort of scripted encounter where he can't die. And that didn't just happen to me. I really hope that was some scripted encounter and I didn't just witness that bullshit with mine own eyes. Alright. Enemy phase. He can Rider's Bane any of my cavalry. Alright. Holy shit. Alright. He's running away to Vulnerary. Great. I. 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 Mm hmm. 
what's next? So let's do uh, finally targeting that as well. And you hit a 6%. After this turn, in this enemy phase, the pause and take a break. Because I'm going to lose my mind. Absolutely lose my mind. Who are you targeting? Also, Asbel? Alright, I'm at the point where I can't... E. I can't hide behind forests anymore. So I think I might just have Osain and Tanya run along, have their 20 speed and support bonuses helping each other out. And then we'll just see if I'm allowed to exist. Oh, wait. I, there are still Dragonites that can attack. We got to get through those first. I should have brought... If I lose this chapter, I'm bringing Marita down here so that she can nail these guys into fucking oblivion. Also, they want to use the Javelin instead of the Rider's Bane when Finn is right there? I mean, I'm not, I'm not complaining, mind you. It just seems like that's kind of the most threatening thing you have, and you're using it not at all. But, whatever. You're, this is a free country, you can do what you want. Well, actually, the point of this game is that it's very much not a free country for you guys, but... Actually, America isn't even the most free country in... You can do what you want! I won't... I won't stop you! Uh, however... I... I'm sorry if I'm just rambling, but uh, my brain needs a second. It's luck times three. 42. That 42% chance activated six times consecutively. Ugh. <sighs> All right, so for a frame of reference, I took a break after that to calm down. An entire day has passed. Um, I am in a better mood now, I think. So, let's, uh, let's see how that goes for me. And we'll see if this better mood ends up sticking around. So... Here we go. First encounter. Encounter. I'm, I was watching a Pokemon stream. First battle. Alright, so Miracle. Alright. Okay. There is a light at the end of this tunnel. Okay, let's have Finn fall back into the safety of the grass. Now... This guy will only hurt us if we go forward on these javelin, toxic, venom lancing, anti toxin bastards. But that can. We, like, don't have to do that. It's, it's pretty easy to not do that, in fact. So, okay. Kalyan will actually crit on the second attack here. Will it be enough to get a kill? I don't think so. Alright, but that's actually fine that that happened. Because we should... Keyword, should... Should be able to get a kill on him. And we'll use... Hmm. We'll use Xavier to get it? Xavier? Sure, alright. Please. Please, Xavier. Oh, that was a crit. Th or not, it was just a hit. Okay. Well, it looks to me... Like we're starting to get something here. Alright. So, Edda will actually capture? Yeah, because antitoxins sound really helpful. At least just to have one. Like, I might not care about the javelin... God is real and he exists to mock me. Alright. Nah, okay. Who has better avoid? 56, 84. So. 
Fergus will go right there. I'm aware the reason he has so much avoid is due to the charm. That's why I am now moving Nana down. And she will heal Dermo. And no, she will heal Xavier. Staff, heal up. Oh, hang on. Let's equip the Paragon Sword. Staff, heal up Xavier. Get him to uh, better levels. Doodly doo. Nice. XP will go up. We will level up, and it'll be a good level. Is Nana normally this terrible? I feel like I'm just exceedingly unlucky. Alright, and then Salem. He will heal up uh, Dermo. Or Dermot. Delmond. Uh-huh. Some XP acquired. Good for him. And then... Well, really... I think I just move right here and right here, and now my cavalry can't be attacked by anyone. Yeah. And we'll equip the iron sword so she isn't weighed down. Okay. And Leaf will... I guess he'll equip the light brand and visit this house. It's already been 20 years. Oh, if I were just 10 years younger, I'd drop everything to fight with you folks. Here, I'll give you my favorite sword. Mayhaps if you use it, I'll still be fighting in some way. Ooh! Um, sure. Pretty cool of you, old man. Oh, right, and then there's, um, Karen. I have to make sure that she doesn't get, like, attacked. It's probably still not safe to drop Shannon, But I'm gonna drop Shannon. Alright. And then beyond that... Oh, Ma Marita. Mm, wait. Sure. Okay. More of those bastards. But their chances to hit are like nothing. So that's fine. Alright. Coming at me with a javelin. Alright, very cool of you. And then, slowly but surely, these Wyvern Riders are falling. Uh, uh, yeah. Trying to hit Osian. Not gonna work. In fact, you're probably also gonna try to hit Osian. And let me tell you, not gonna... Ooh, wait, that might work. That might work. That didn't work. Just imagine thinking that would work. I never thought that would work. Because it just wasn't gonna work, you know? Alright, here we go. Uh, you're just gonna die to Leaf. Ah, yes, my old friend Purple Triangle. Woo, dodge. And hit him. Okay, so these guys aren't a threat. That's something weird I've noticed. Thracian enemies will be like, Mmm, I will have Rider's Bane, Toxic Lances, and Powerful Lances to deal damage. And then they're like, Ooga Booga Javelin. And they don't use their really good weapons. Alright. We just gotta we just gotta kill these Wyvern Riders so I can go up and kill that ballista so it's safer for me to start moving forward. But hey, will that ever happen? Yeah, okay, get out of here. Finn almost is gonna level up again, that's pretty cool. Right. You're going after Dermo, which. Someone please explain to me why the Bayo Blade gives Vantage and Wrath. What? Oh god, I was like really confused for a second, but no. Thank god that man used that vulnerary. Oh god, the very thing I just said. What's Kalen's chance to dodge? Alright. Oh, it's Fergus! Alright, well... I had thought I had properly protected all my non-Fin cavalry. It turns out I didn't, but it's fine. Oh, just gonna get hit by a 9%. Okay, that's fine, fine. Hey, and you're attacking with the Javelin, despite the fact that you could reach him with your Rider's Bane. Can anyone explain these guys to me? Because I am genuinely at a loss. 
All right, there's his um adept proking. Now, wait. Oh, he has Nile. So my adept can't proc, nor my vantage. All right, well. Player phase, okay. All right. The priority here is killing the Dragon Knights. So let's kill them. Finn. Attack with the Brave Lance. Let's see, you... 12, 12... What is your follow-up crit coefficient? Just one. Mm. I think then it would be better if Dean attacked? Mm, no, he gets weighed down by quite a bit. I could move my units with Charm in closer, though. Which I think is what I'm going to do. I'm going to start with Karen attacking this one. I can protect Shanam now, at this at this point. Alright. Little scared about her getting hit, but she also landed a crit, so it kind of just evens out. Uh, can you get a level up of strength? Or a level up of anything? Alright, well... Groovy. You definitely help, though, Karen. I, I can't take that away from you. Alright. Brave Lance... Mm, Brave Lance is running low, but that's what lances exist to do. Kill things. Oh. Wait a minute. No, that wasn't Miracle. Hold on. None of, neither of those hits were lethal blows. He just dodged two 99s back to back. All right, all right. Let's see what we've got here. All right, this is... Look, this looks really good for Fergus. Just don't have Miracle proc. Thank you. Okay. All right. Now. This guy is a problem. This guy is a big problem. However, all of these guys in front of him are also a problem. Let's see, 25 minus 10. Hmm. All right, Salem right here with wind. 37 minus 5. He does kind of outright kill him if Miracle doesn't activate. The problem is, if he doesn't kill him here, 21, and he doubles with his, um... All right, here's what I want to do. I'm going to want to get my units with, um... Shit, what is it? All right, how about this? We attack with Leaf and the Light Brand. This brings this... that This brings this guy down considerably. All right, here we go. Let's, let's start doing this nicely here. Boom. Followed by... Uh... Boom. Good. Oh, wait a minute. That was a depth proking. All right. There we go. This makes it so that, mm, theoretically, that guy should die very easily. Unless Miracle would like to activate again. All right. What are my best chances here? All right. If Etta has an, uh, the Killer Lance equipped, does she double him? She does. All right. Let's try this. Oh! Oh! Thank you, Edda! Your Majesty, I'm sorry. I couldn't get the fuck out of here. Get out. Dragon Knighted! Ooh. Level up. Ah. Uh, now that's a flyer. Now that is a flyer. Okay. So with that out of the way... Mm-hmm. This is something that I'm not too keen on doing, but... Um... It's what I have to do... Given, um... Circumstance. 
Like, I gotta move them out eventually. But there is a vulnerary on both of them. Which is fine. Now, beyond that... There's still this asshole. So, let's give it to... This isn't gonna work. Yeah, no. Um... Well, I would like to heal Kalyan and Fergus. We could give it to Dermo. Or Derma. Whatever it is, I'm doing it wrong. Uh, yeah. Unless... Unless Miracle procs, this is also a kill. Hey, there we go. Alright, so there we go, there we go, there we go. Now I actually should be able... To capture me, some uh, some antitoxins. That'll be pretty cool. Let's first get Macha back up to living, and there we go. Very important first step. All right. Um, Macha can't capture any of these guys, but I don't think she has. An existent chance of getting hit by them. I say, as I'm fairly certain just last time she got hit by him, but we don't need to talk about that. Luna! I sure am glad you can look at their five defense. Thank God for that. Alright. No XP gain, but what am I expecting? They're generic foot soldiers. Alright. So, with this. Um. Yeah, Xavier. I think Xavier's better off just outright killing them. Or no, wait, if he captures with the Iron Blade, 12, our causes should activate. Oh, but only activate one more round of combat and can't kill him. Oops. In which case, Kalyan will... All right. Z yeah, Xavier has the room for all that shit. He will capture this one with his Iron Lance... He will capture this one. Well, he only has Iron Lances. Shit. 14 minus 6 is 8. Oh, but his follow-up crit coefficient should be enough. I have to get pretty unlucky for him to not crit. Alright, see? There we go. Good job, Kalyan. Alright, so we'll just nab that real quick. Uh, yeah, there's Dermot. Xavier will take trade. He'll grab all that for himself. And then he will release. And then I'll just kill these last two. Even though is Kalyan in danger of death? No, he's not. He's especially when I move Nana in to make sure that he's uh he's gonna be okay. So, just looking at who's in range of the Ballista... It's only Macha, anyway. Wait a minute. He's fine. Dean, attack. <laughs> just grossly, grossly overuse your power to kill this thie uh, thief. Good lord. This soldier. Get him out of here. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Then move him to this house, I guess. I guess I should also be watching out for these. Or, like, all of these. Holy cow. Oh, and this. Oh, Christ. I don't like... I don't like it. Uh, bu -bu -bu bum Right. Shannon, what are you capable of here? He can do six damage. If Adept procced on both attacks, he still wouldn't be able to kill. Alright. Let's get him out of here. Behold the power of the Earth Sword. Zoom, 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 zoom. Bam. Oh, a crit. Nice. All right. Though, do note to self: next time I play the game, giving the Paragon Sword to Nana when she's healing sounds like a pretty cool thing I can do. Uh, making sure, yeah, right next to Nana, Shannon cannot be attacked. Uh, who still has to move? Marita. Uh-huh. It's Marita. Yeah. Marita. 
And then add, all right, there we go. So, after all of that suffering, excuse me. Okay, after all of that suffering, turns out there is yet more suffering. And they're going right for Osian and Tanya. Fuck. Well. I suppose I will have to make haste then. Shouldn't be too hard. Now the problem is, what if they have a higher chance to hit Osian and Tanya than I thought? And they actually don't. Alright, that's good. That part, good. I like that part. Yeah, you're both going to go after Tanya, and it's not going to go well for... Ooh, that one might... Okay, yeah, no, we're fine. Okay. So. They're not even trying... Well, this one's trying to attack Matcha. The other one was just like, Chief, this ain't working out. All right. Yeah, you're going after Finn some more. It... Yeah, get out of here. You're just feeding him experience points. Six at a time, he will overtake you. Is he actually using the Venom? Oh, no, he's just attacking someone else with a Javelin. Okay, so... Yeah, and that one's also attacking Matcha. Congratulations, you all have accomplished nothing but wasting my time. I will expect to be paid back in full for this. Player phase... Alright. So, looking at this... Uh, yeah, let's have Dermot right up here and just annihilate this guy right here. Boom. Bam! Alright. A little bit of XP doesn't matter. Because now Matcha... Um, I guess we'll move him to, like, right here. Yeah, Matcha can finally get rid of this fucker. Alright, do I need to use the silver sword for it? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Alright. This is fine. Ooh, the crit! Alright. So with that done, I can now move my flyers that extra millisecond for millimeter forward before they're uh, dealt with by these guys. However, that can be lived with. Leaf, I think I'm just going to have Leaf go. Yeah, he's just going to go. He'll be under fire by three... Four Ballistas. That might actually be... Well, not if he's within range of, um... Uh, Charm, he won't be, a, he won't be in danger. Alright. We'll put him right here... Yeah, because right here, I can put Nana right here. He has a support bonus and two charms. He should be fine. Though that does remind me that I probably should have... Um, I was about to say that I probably should have brought the Kingmaker, but I clearly did. I just forgot about it. I guess that's what happens when you leave a whole episode in a tilted rage and then come back a day later. Or something like that, I don't know. Vendor, what do you have in here? Alright, wind magic. Let me buy... Three of the... Yeah, three of those. Wind magic, pretty cool. Gotta admit. Um, and then as for this one, Edda can just... Throw Iron Lance, yeah, throw Iron Lance... Kill him dead. Slam. Oh, wait, because he's on the arena. The background's the arena. Ah, that's kind of cool. I like that. What a cute little detail. Um, I still can't go too far forward with her. I almost did. I didn't realize that was the fringe space that it was. Oh, wait, 86? What's Leaf Stodge right now? 73. Man, with Nana there, it'll be like... A lot. That's fine. Alright. Uh. Hmm. Uh, you can heal. No, no, you can't. Demot's not injured. Tally will. Uh, 
Actually, no, I know, I know what I want you to do. Uh, say like, attack, Jamungand. Delete this man off the face of the earth. God, it looks so cool. Bye-bye. Is that weapon level going to increase anytime soon? I don't think it is. But I can believe. Because his speed is now three. Hmm. Ah, dark magic. I wish you were better. All right. Um, Kalyan will kill this guy. Yeah, he'll kill him, go up one space, and then get healed by Nana. Bam. Dodge. Crit. So there we go. There's that. Paragon, really not helping him much given his level. Okay. Now Nana will come over here. She'll heal him up. We'll just hold that fast forward button. There we go. So. Wait. Yeah, yeah. Karen. Oh god, I didn't realize how low Karen was. Well, regardless, we'll just have her wait right there. Not in danger of anything. And then... Dean will... I guess Dean will go right here? It looks like he can get inside that ballista's range from there. I don't know. Xavier will move right there. Finn will start riding up. And now it's time for all of this. Your hit is 87. Oh, your void is 73. Yeah, you're all 87. 82. 83. Yeah, wait a minute. I'm not... You're the closest thing to something I'm afraid of. But I'm still not afraid of any of you. On, on either of them. Alright. If I attack with the killer bow... Let's, um... I think Osian is the thing I'd want to attack with first. Yeah. Alright, so here's how this is going to go. Osian is going to attack from right here. Yeah, and this should... His follow-up crit modifier, I think, is like 100% here. Yeah. Bye bye Because someone thought giving you a second Vogue was an intelligent des game design decision. Alright, and then beyond that, Tanya can move right here with the killer bow. Yeah, 58 crit, and yours is 2. Yup, that'll crit, that'll kill. It was really likely to do that anyway, but... Eh. Though, wait a minute, that does lower her attack speed by a bit. Fuck, fine. Is having two less attack speed really gonna lower her dodge enough to the point where I'm in danger? Please don't let the answer to that question be something that concerns me. It shouldn't. Alright. Marita will be able, and Asbel will be able to move just as soon as I can kill one of the ballistas. I don't even need to kill both of them, I just need to get one of them out of there. Why is it always on those moves? Alright. That's what I was afraid of, but what I kind of figured. Yo, what the fuck? Oh god, we gotta deal with these re-warping fuckers. Where did you even come from? There's nothing there for you to come out of. Alright, well. Warping. Oh, wow. Amazing. Alright, let's get this out of the way. Oh, Cyan is getting... I have to get ex extraordinarily unlucky for Osian to be in danger here. I'm fairly certain that this is just going to be a complete and utter wipe. God bless you, Wrath. God bless. Beautiful. Though I do think I should definitely start moving my forces out. Alright. Uh-huh. You are attacking Matcha, I think that was? Alright, wow, even on a fort, her evasion is... Oh, well, her defense is so high, too. Really? That's who you chose? Okay. Alright. Well... How likely is he to get hurt? 100%, apparently. Well, good thing Xavier has those, uh, 
those antitoxins. And also, good thing there are infinitely spawning antitoxins. It is as though the game foresaw this being a problem. Alright, there we go. Now, Tanya is going to get attacked up close by that Elfire one. But that shouldn't be a problem. Anyways, here's Kalyan. He's fine. Alright. Oh no, you can't reach her from there. Huh. Well, this is also likely to be a... D yep. And then a crit. Bam! Okay. Looking good, looking good. Level up for Tanya to boot. The only thing she really needs at this point is strength, right? Or, you know what? I, you're right, you're right. She needed absolutely nothing. I was a little mistaken. And what do you have, a great bow? Well, when I put him in a forest next turn, his chances to get hit that were already, like, nothing are going to be super nothing. So, okay. More strength, probably? Alright, there we go. Osayan has become my most, like, well-rounded individual. There we go, that heals up. Yeah, that's unfortunate, but manageable. Yeah, I was about to say, it looks like I can just get up in this guy's face. Alright. Whoosh! Master Lance! Oh, this is just gonna outright annihilate this goddamn ballista. You have mocked me for the last time, Mr. Ballistician! Nice. Alright. So that's taken care of. Alright. Um, Leaf. Yeah, Leaf is just gonna begin his assault into here. Which, hmm. His avoid is 93, but that's on a... With the charms, but he's also about to move out of, um... Out of range of a plank. He's moving into a forest. That is the sentence I was trying to say. So, he shouldn't... Yeah, 83. His dodge suffers a little bit, but... Really, not that much. Alright. So... How far can Etta fly up? Oh, she can kill that. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Alright, but first of all... I think I'm gonna, at this point, have Xavier on, um, Fortress Duty. Yeah, yeah, this is... He and Matra will stop the Infinite Soldiers. There doesn't seem to be a whole lot I can do about the Infinite Sorcerers, but some things just gotta kinda take. So... Slowly walking up. Unfortunately for you, he has a cost. But a valiant effort, Mr. Lopter Loptrian. Loptrian? Lopterian? Whatever. Could probably use another rewarp staff, so I am going to try and capture him. Probably with Fergus and the Kingsmaker. It, he'll do it, it's just going to be a little painful. But Salem's right there to heal you up, as is Nana. If this even hits. This might not hit. Yeah, eat shit. And perfect. We have... We have ourselves another rework. And a level up for Fergus. Hmm. Strength, skill, cool. Actually, these infinite spawning dudes could be, uh... Perfect for, um... For infinite money. Now that I think about it, let me let me take these Dramungans and see how much they sell for when I go to buy weapons from that shop. I have a feeling that's going to be pretty helpful. Anyways, Macha is going to remain there. Finn, do you have the uh, space for you? Do okay. Finn is going to take. He is going to trade. You're going to pocket the Dramungand and the Rewarp, and he's just going to let you go. 
Um, problem is, hang on, nah, hang on. This is this is easily solved. We are going to trade, take an antitoxin. Perfect. Mm hmm. Is it really worth it just to put not? Nah, I feel like Dermo might actually just get hit by everything and die. Like, what's his avoid right now? 56 in the forest? Yeah, no. No, Leaf will be fine on his own. Yeah, Leaf will be completely fine on his own. A little risky, but fine. Uh, beyond this, Karen needs healing. Dermo needs his poison cured. So, I was trying to have them all move over in one turn. Didn't work out, but hey. Antitoxin. Perfect. Like, we can move him forward a bit. Not too far, though. Yeah, I think, like... Yeah, that was it. That was the extent of how far I could move him. And Nana's probably fine to be moved, to be honest. So we'll do that. Nana, stick by your brother. Heal up, but do not move any farther forward. I could also move them up and to the right to help Osayan and uh, Tanya. But I don't think those lovebirds need any help. They might soon, but right now I think they're fine. Uh, Karen, attack, steel lance. Can't kill. Salem, attack with Jermungan because it looks fucking cool. Ooh, spooky ghost faces, dead. All right. A little bit of XP, a little bit. I wonder if I should have given the speed ring to him, because then he would, like, he'd be able to use Jermungand and not get weighed down. I'd like it all. But that would just be showing a little bit too much favoritism, I think. So, we'll just have Edo wait where she is. Same with Matcha. Alright. So with this, now we can go up to here. First order of business, Tanya. Yeah. No! That wasn't who I wanted her to attack, but the guy will still die, so it ultimately doesn't matter. Yeah, the, the, the difference is pretty negligible. Alright. So that guy is Dunskis. Now as for you, you were also going to be Dunskis. Yep, alright. The ballistas are out of here. Well, most of them. In the upper part, anyway. So, with that done... Just to make sure he can attack... He can attack below the right side of... You know, this is fine right here. And then Asbel... Ooh! Do I... Do I really want to move in forward? What's your attack? 14? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, no, this is... Just as long as I don't move him in range of, like... Oh, hang on, wait a minute, that ballista's still there. Or wait a minute, no, Asbel can move just out of its range. Is that... Is that just out of its range? Yeah, it is. And then you can hit him, but... And you can do no damage, and... Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Okay. Asbel can get over there. I wish it told me the book's weight. That'd have been something that's helpful. Eh, yeah, fuck it. Griff Caliber. Alright. More of those guys. Probably more of these guys. Oh, they can, they're just going to attack Dean for free. I didn't think of that. Oh, God. Oh, God. If they both land at 50-50, they kill him. Oh, no. I just assumed they were going to re-warp. I... Oh, no. I didn't even think of that. Maybe this guy has less magic. 23 minus 2. And he has a higher hit? <sighs> Alright. 
I'm going to use this time to figure out what's in that church and hate myself. So just... Uh-huh. Yep. Mm, super fast. Oh, good for you, Tanya. You got some stats. Oh, and he got put to... Wait, what? How did he get put to sleep? Wait a minute. Apply sleep on contact. So I got double screwed. Did they even bring the restore staff with me? I did. I'll give myself that much credit. But I have to redo everything all over again. The fighting will only become more intense as you draw closer to the Imperial base to the east. Keep hold of this pure water. It's just a pure water. Great. <sighs> Let me just check what's in this armory. All the silver weapons. Okay, that's really cool. How much does Jermungan sell for? Pretty penny. Alright. Give me some entertainment, Shan. I'm fighting the arena. I'm up for some blood sport. 800 gold? Yep. Alright. Let's see if Shannon can beat this Baron. Alright. I'll see you guys after a transition. Alright. We're back. Um... I realized how much easier this was now that I realized that that's just a pure water. And I don't care about it. So I just moved everyone down here. And, um, wouldn't you know it? No time against all the dragon knights. Miracle didn't proc once. Yeah. It just. Whatever was making life hard for me last time just didn't make life hard for me this time. And I'm really happy for it. Wait, this doesn't kill it here. Oh, well, a death will activate, so, you know. Fine. Never punished for my mistakes. Not once, not ever. So, yep. I have just completely ignored the top end of the map. It's not real. I, uh, I don't consider it to be real. So, it's not real. Simple as that. All right. So Nana will move in right there. Uh-huh. Um, I need to make sure that I don't move too many units into a compromising position. Um, she's on the forest. I would like to move Dermot up there. I mean, with this... One, two, yeah, all of those units get charm. And what I think I can do is just in case Dermot himself is in a bit of a tricky circumstance, I can put Fergus right there. And then as for all of these chuckle fucks, if I just keep these two spaces covered, they can't get past me. So, yeah, that's fine by me. Alright. Uh, the one thing I do need to keep track of is the fact that those Jermungand bastards are going to start spawning in soon. So I want to be ready for them. So, yeah. We'll just... We'll just get ready for them. Alright. And that's how we'll position things here. Those guys are coming in, and I believe this is when the Jermungands show up. Yep, there they are. Material into existence. Sometimes the game just pauses, and I don't know why it's taking a while to catch up. Alright. So, let's see if we're going to have one of those classic first turns I come back, things go wrong. Alright. So far, so good. Who is that going after? I could not tell. Fergus, who... Of course, 
He gets hit by the 19%. Alright, well, Dermot's getting blasted, but... Yeah, this should be... Yeah, I dodged the two roughly 40% so they get hit by the 19. You know how it goes. Y'all have been here long enough. Alright. Going through. Alright, this is a Baltine. Yeah. Osain, if you get hit by this, uh, yeah, okay, we're fine. Uh-huh. Little bit of XP, cool, cool. Nana's gonna get attacked by the blizzard. Yeah. Please. It's gonna be so annoying to heal this if you... Alright, 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 there we go. Alright, experience has been acquired. Player phase, alright. Yeah, Fergus is gonna be hurt, but... D d whatever. Yeah, let me... Those guys just didn't re-warp. Uh, uh, okay. That's fine. Alright, and looking at this... Oh. Like, he has uh, 3 to 10, and he doesn't move. So, 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Yeah, if Leaf moves in right here... And attacks this guy... Yeah, Leaf is not targetable by either of those mages. So, bye bye Armor Knight. Nice, level up. Uh, you really only need more skill, which you're not getting despite having the skill scroll. What the hell, Leaf? Well, whatever. You, whatever. Alright. So now... Yeah, that's still a forest tile. We'll just... Vogue. And take care of this ballista. Mm-hmm. Good job, Osian. And then while we're here, we can take care of the other ballista. Yep. Right here like this. Not that guy. This guy. And both Venom Ballistas are out of commission. Nice. Still a little worried about someone potentially getting hit by Blizzard. However, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. What's her evasion now? 91? Okay, so she has a bit of a higher chance to get hit by it. But I can now move Fergus a little closer. As well as keeping Finn nearby. So that, um... Restore... Yeah. As well as keeping Fergus nearby with the Kingmaker so that she can get an extra boost. And now he's not poisoned. Which is a pretty big plus. Alright. The problem is, though... Yeah, that space is a little bit dangerous. So, what if... Now, hear me out. And let me think about this here. Yeah, the only problem... Well... Dermot's still in range of this one. But that's it. Right? Yeah. The problem is Dermot's resistance is probably not very, uh, good. Yeah, magic of five. So, let's... What is your avoid? 57. It would become 67 with the range of another charm user. Yeah, okay. Heal up Fergus. Then... Hmm, what do I want to do? Well, now that Leaf's right in their face, I don't really need to worry about his um, bonuses. So I can actually move Dermot and Nana out of there. And then Shannon can go to the supply. He can give them the three wind tomes. Not pure water. And he can take uh, things I want to sell. The 19 Eustermungand. Alright. And I'll just make sure... Yeah, that Edda and Dean aren't in range of that. 
So, how many spaces down from uh, Dermot? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then you're right there. Yep, okay. Alrighty then. And then everyone else can just remain where they are. Or no, Fergus back up to like... Uh... Right here, I guess. Alright. I think that's it. Yep, okay. Unsurprisingly, this goon squad shows up again. Yeah, and those guys just haven't warped. Ah, I see they've decided to... <laughs> That's never going to stop being funny. Alright, now where are you going to show up? That is quite possibly the single most inconvenient spot you could show up. However... Osian... Got him. All right. 91 XP. Uh-huh. You're going to get attacked again. No biggie. Osian is going to continue to assert an unbelievable amount of dominance. Ooh, and he's almost going to... He's going to level up, too. All right. Well, Tanya has to get attacked first, but, uh... Yeah, as you can see, that percent to hit is not... Tell me why I was still scared that that would hit. What has this game done to me? Alright. So I can very easily kill the boss with either Osian or Tanya right here. But how greedy am I going to get for that Blizzard Tome? Just luck. Okay, well, whatever. When every one of your attacks is a critical hit, does uh, do you really need strength? So don't get me wrong. Definitely would be nice. Definitely would be nice. Alright. So here comes Marita. Or Matcha. Nice. Uh, are you going to get some stats? No, you're not even going to get close to a level up. You're just like over leveled to hell. Is that what you are? All right, well, anyways, all of this shit's coming up. I don't really care about it, but it's definitely what's happening. Uh-huh. Okay, you're going after Leaf, but... Yeah, get... Bye-bye. And then... Yeah, you're going after Marita, which shouldn't be a problem. Wow. Really, uh... Really firing through there, aren't you, buddy? Solid hit chance there. Alright. Mm, why is that guy suddenly going the other direction? What? Did I... Well, Leap still isn't likely to get hit. But it does seem as though I've misjudged his hit range. Wait, yeah, no, wait. It shouldn't be one, two... Alright. Well, we'll see how this goes. Alright. I really do want that three-use blizzard. However, I am not... I am not going to object to the prospect of just doing this. Hmm... Capturing him would also be really cool. Uh, but let's get this out of the way before anything else. Yeah. Good job. So, now that both of them are out, now that all the Ballista are gone... And Leaf got that final level up of strength. Now the question gets asked. What do I do from here? I think I start... By, uh... Hmm. Alright. 
maybe by putting a very attractive unit to, uh, to, sl to like, make him want to put to sleep. Oh, man, I am totally greeting out here, trying to, uh, steal that blizzard tome. That's only going to have two uses by the time I get it. But the free ability for Asbel to put, like, anyone on the map to sleep sounds really helpful. Hmm. This is 100% my greed. However, think about it. That's a free... Alright. Well, with one more move over, I can get Edda up there and try and cap... Well, if I had known Dean was just going to do that... Oh, she has an A in Lances as well. She could try it with the Master Lance. Alright. I'm going to sell this Jamungand. And I think the thing that I want the most... Are kind of Silver Lances. It's just... There we go. I am now poor. But... I have lances for Finn... And all that. Now... Here we go. Let's... Earth Sword... Hang on. This is probably a better means of attack. Yep. Alright. We'll just Earth Sword some experience over to Nana... Who I really hope is uh <clears throat> gonna get a good level up soon. Please, I have her with both magic scrolls. Give her some magic. Alright. Mm-hmm. Looking good, I guess. Wait. Um, I, I, hang on, what's your attack speed? Four. Sure. Salem, Jermungand. That's just a free kill. Behold! The power of Jermungand! I really wish I could use dark magic more, because look at how powerful that is. Ooh, look at how nice that is. Mm. Uh, he needs more skill and speed. Do I have the skill and speed scrolls anywhere around here? Doesn't, doesn't look like it. Oh, wait, what is this scroll? Oh, hey, the skill and speed scroll. Just, uh... Just to hand that over. And then Asbel, just because, I mean, why not? He'll pass over Hazel Scroll for... Uh, rewarp, since I don't think he'll be rewarping anywhere soon. Alright. And with that, I think we hit the end turn button? End turn button. Uh-huh. More reinforcements from right there. One more sorcerer is going to spawn in. Let's see how successful this one is at rewarping. Hey, it worked. Stop appearing near there. Hey, I said stop it. All right. Well, how likely? Yeah. Oh, God, that's it. That's a little likely to happen. I don't like that. Okay, well, it's, it's fine. XP going up. Yeah, now all of these guys are going to go, and Marita's just going to kill them, or Macha's just going to kill them all. Ooh, he lived. Interesting. And then we'll just... Yep, Polax one's coming up. Unfortunately for him, Marita is not... Macha is not Marita, first of all. And Macha is not Cavalry. So that's not going to do piss for dick. Alright. Uh-huh. 
They're all moving through. This guy's going to go after Macha, and it's not... Not going to work out the way he thinks. Nice. Ooh, now that's actually experience points. Uh-huh. They are moving. They are certainly moving. Yeah, Marita's going to get attacked here. Got it right this time. And nothing really is going to come of it. All right, there we go. Uh-huh. Yeah, why is, does that one run away? I don't... All right, Tanya's dodge should still be absurd. Yeah. All right. Now, here's the other one. The boss. How's this going to go? Who's he going to target? Tanya as well. And if I'm thinking correctly... All right. Okay. I am not going to get a much better chance to capture him than I am this turn. So let's do that. Uh, hmm. First order of business. How well can Edda do it with her killer lance? What's her follow-up crit coefficient? Only one. Yours is three. But, yeah, you can't reach him. What Edda can probably capture... And by probably, I mean fairly likely to. We'll just have Tanya kill this one. Attack, kill her bow. Yeah, just get, get him out of here. Ooh, adapt activated. Cool. All right. Mm-hmm. Level up. Hey, someone who needed level strength, leveled strength. Cool. Alright. Now, Osian. With the Vogue. He would have to crit, like, both attacks to do this. Because the second one's a guaranteed crit. So it's 34 minus 16. Hang on, let me, let me think. What about Leaf with the Brave Sword, huh? Brave Sword. Oh, he's not bulky enough to capture the boss. Damn it. Alright, well. Maybe Etta can damage him just regularly? Rider's Bane. The hit's not very good, but the 13 and then the 13 would do it. Meanwhile, with the Killer Lance, she's liable to kill him. But, I still think that it would be worth a shot to try. Yeah, okay, let's try it. Attack, Killer Lance. On my honor as a soldier, I'll defend this fort to the end. Alright, so there's one crit. Oh, wait, no. That was all that had to happen. Well. Well. Today on, I don't know how to do math. And now I could end the chapter... Right here and now. No, uh... No negative repercussions. Hold on. Capture. Vogue. Yeah, hang on. Capture. Vogue. This just works. Yeah, no, this is just gonna work. Mm-hmm. So then, I've gotten that one. He's captured. And then all Leaf has to do is... Oh god, trade with Edda, who only has two free inventory spaces. 
Ah, uh, fuck. And this guy has, like, three things I want. Boltine. Well, the Boltine's almost extinguished, so I kind of think I just want the Fortify. So let's just get some experience before this whole thing ends. So, Salem, you are double-scrolled up. One-shot this guy. And uh, show me the level up. Give me. All right. Level up for you. And we get... Health and Luck. That is an odd combination of stats to get on the scrolls that you have. All right. Who else is close to leveling up? Anyone? Callion, just on the fact of who he is. Um... Let's, uh... I guess Fergus can attempt? That would... No, he doubles with that and kills him. Yeah, 19 and 19. Yeah, no, this is fine. Bye-bye. Is he gonna level up off of that? No. No, of course not. Ooh, sword rank's gonna go up, though. That's cool. Um, is anyone here hurt? No. Hmm. Well, I guess the only way to do this is to kill a paladin. Which is what you would be, Nana, if your uh, stats weren't poor. Alright. Bam. And then the second kill will be... Second hit will be a kill. Mmm... Bam. Now, is that going to be enough for a level up? I'm not sure. Maybe? Yeah, there we go. All right, please. Some magic or something. You have both magic scrolls. Ah. All right. That's all I feel like milking. I don't need to milk anything else here. All right. So, leaf. Trade. Yeah, and we want the, uh, I guess the Bolting and the Psychic? Raid with Edda. Give her a uh, odd scroll in the vulnerary. Trade with the freeze. Take Baltine and the physic. And then we seize. Would have been way cooler if that was with the boss, but. Mm. Anything of import inside the fort, Augustus? Yeah, rhymes. Hmm. The fort is completely vacant. Seems to be deserted. By the look of it, this place was once a prison camp, but it's not in use anymore. I see. Then if there's nothing requiring our attention, we should hurry ahead to the River Thracia. Once we cross it, we'll be at Munster's doorstep. Ha! Easier said than done, my prince. I have no doubt the enemy is waiting for us. They have likely established a defensive line at the river. We still have some way to go before our goal. See to it that you don't let your guard down. All right. Thank you guys for uh, watching Chapter 21, The War of Miracle. Coming up next, it's Chapter 22, Beyond the River. I'll see you guys then. Take care.